And moving on to Nigeria's transportation sector, train passengers on Lagos Ibadan route may be in for better times as Nigerian Railway Corporation intends to increase the speed of the facility and frequency this year. Managing Director of the Corporation, Fidet Ohiria, says this means reduction in travel time and quality service to more passengers in Nigeria. Lillian Ezemark reports. Passengers at Nigerian Railway Corporation Ebutameta Lagos preparing to catch a train to Ibadan. A passenger, Deji Hasstrop, who retired from public service, is traveling to Ibadan for his vacation. He had a train ride more than 40 years ago at the same station. He queues to buy his tickets at the same narrow gauge station. Where we did all the ticketing and the boarding is actually part of the narrow gauge. Uh, station. It has nothing to do with the standard gauge. But again, we're hoping that by next month, the standard gauge station will be there and then we'll move in there and then start all our operation. Next, he registered on the passenger manifest before boarding. Seat number four. On board the standard gauge Lagos Ibadan train service are first class, business and economy seats. But one thing cuts across the trips, passengers' compliance with COVID-19 protocols. The capacity for this coach is 24, but because of the COVID-19 protocol, we've reduced our capacity to 16. And Nelson standby attends to medical issues on board. While I'm on the train, I walk around just to see how uh, passengers are faring. And so far, I've not seen any sign. Like I've not, really, I've really not seen such cases. And then before they come in, actually, they check for the temperature too. Okay. Okay. So. Sir. With restroom. The information board. On board entertainment. Passengers say there's still room for improvement. The schedule is okay, but it's enough for the moment. What do you mean? There should be, as a train is taking off from Ibadan at 8, there should be one taking off from Lagos as well as 8. And what it means is that those working in Ibadan can actually stay in Lagos and come back from Ibadan in the evening. The reception needs to be improved. It's so um, dusty, it can create a good office where people can register their names and get their tickets. That would be very great. At Ibadan, Mr. Hastrop shares his experience on the ride. I, I think that they've done a really good job of it. I, there's still much to do. I mean, there are several stations on the way that I see they're still constructing those stations. But um, uh, one thing that we... I have noticed in the past is we lack maintenance culture and that's something that we, we have to take particular care of because something this nice and beautiful should, should be sustained. For the managing director Nigerian Railway Corporation, the train service is work in progress. All the gains made during the last Christmas year short will be consolidated this year. The agenda of the government is to be able to move product out of the seaport to the hinterland. And uh, for good transportation, the rail is the most efficient and effective way because we move in bulk and they move masses, they move many people. People will keep their car because they are going to be parked and ride. We are going to provide spaces for people to park and join the train and go to any place they want to go to. The train service has taken stress off the roads. But the passengers hope that the corporation sticks to scheduled maintenance of the facility, be customer centric and render world-class service that is safe, reliable and affordable. Lillian Ezemark, TVC News, Lagos.